Some cars speeding through your neighborhood or maybe backed up at a long light. Some San Antonio City Council members say that traffic is one of the top concerns they hear about from residents. They tell City Hall reporter Garrett Berger what they think the city can do to make tackling those problems easier. In a city of nearly one and a half million, there are more than a few cars zipping through San Antonio neighborhoods and more than a few complaints about them. It's one of the top concerns we hear again and again at neighborhood meetings is speeding. District 7 Councilwoman Marina Aldarete Gavito and District 2 Councilman Jalen McKee Rodriguez have requested the city conduct a San Antonio-wide traffic analysis. Since the pandemic, there's been a change in driver patterns that make driving in San Antonio to be a very frustrating experience. They hope that such a broad look could lead to proactive solutions for traffic issues like congestion or speeding and a better idea of which areas need the most help. So let's say that we get the analysis done and we see heavy speeding on uh, Braun and Bandera. We can work with SAPD uh, to say, hey, we need some more traffic patrol there. We can work with Public Works to say maybe more stop signs are needed there. It's not clear exactly how much work this idea might involve or how long it could take. I imagine it'll be a fairly heavy lift. We would be one of the largest cities in the country to embark on something like this. A city spokesman said the transportation and public works departments are working with the city manager's office to, quote, identify traffic concerns and improvements. City staff will recommend next steps when the idea comes up at the council's governance committee. Garrett Berger, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.